Business news now, and the Bank of England have announced interest rates are set to I'm arrive. sorry, Paul, I'm going to have to interrupt you there. We're just getting reports of some astonishing breaking news. It appears that an invasion of the Earth by an unknown but vastly powerful extraterrestrial aggressor is underway. <laughs> Details are sketchy, but reports are pouring in from across the world of vast, metallic, crab-like creatures laying waste to all they encounter. <laughs> so, a massive and unstoppable alien attack threatens the Earth. What's your reaction? Are you affected by the end of civilization as we know it? What's your perspective? Maybe you live on Earth or know someone who does. How do you feel about it? Email us with your thoughts on your imminent molecular evaporation at bbc.co.uk slash emergency apocalypse address, all one word, and let us know. And already this issue seems to be one that's provoked a lot of comment. Lucinda Richards from London asks, will these so-called aliens be required to pay the congestion charge? <laughs> Somehow, I think not. It's one rule for us and another rule for alien beings. And Gerard from Dover called our letterline number to say, as someone approaching my 80th birthday, I think I'm entitled to comment, "'Twas ever thus. I can remember when a certain Mr Hitler bethought himself to overthrow this sceptered isle, and like him, I think these aliens might find that simple British folk are rather harder to conquer than... And then it just tails off into screams. <laughs> Uh, a quick update for any of you for some reason more interested in the news than what some people who don't know think about the news. London has fallen to the aliens. But more importantly, I can also tell you that Sophie from Manchester says, say what you like about the alien killer crabs, but by God they can organise an invasion. <laughs> we have a lot to learn from them, though we'd better be quick. <laughs> And lastly, on a lighter note, Carl from Aundel writes, Where's Doctor Who when you need him? In fiction, I imagine. <laughs> He's right there, worse luck. <laughs> yes, indeed, because we're running out of time, both on the programme and just generally. My producer tells me that the giant alien crabs have breached TV centre and will imminently vaporise us all. And remember, if you want to see that for yourself, why not log on to our behind-the-scenes webcam? Simply go to bbc.co.uk slash watchusfry, all one word, and click on...